in the house in Wellington. Wow, look at that sunset. So we're heading now to the bus station. Mason's meeting us there. And there we're going to be getting the bus to Rotorua. Wow, look at that. I reckon, Faye, that's the best sunset we've had since being in New Zealand, would you say? Hey, Basil. Hey, Basil. Basil. Hello. Good boy. Good boy, Basil. Come on, come on. Good boy. We've arrived in Rotorua after a terrible coach ride. Come here, you. He's gonna die in here. See? <laughs> Basil. Basil. Coach ride was awful because we couldn't sleep. Well, I don't know, how did you two sleep on the coach? Faye didn't sleep. How did you sleep, Mason? About 10 minutes. Did you? Yeah. Mason slept for 10 minutes. I, I obviously slept the longest. I did like three hours, three or four hours. The weather is unbelievably crap here in Rotorua. So, no idea what we're doing today. We were going to do some outdoor activities, but the weather is just really restricting us from doing that. So I reckon we're going to go to a shopping mall. But I don't know what's happening. We'll have to see. I don't think we'll be doing anything unless these two hurry up. You two ready? <laughs> Please be what? Putting me socks on. Hurry up, man. <laughs> Loud, isn't it? So at the moment we're at um, a Maori village and this village about a hundred years ago was flattened by a volcano. Yeah. That volcano there. So all of this was just like demolished by um, lava. Oh really? So that's yeah. how yeah. that's how deep it was there, that's yeah. how deep the lava would have got. And then they dug it all out. Four days and still alive when he came out. A guy was trapped in where? In that hut up there. For four days? Yeah. Really? It was the same guy that lived to be 110. Faye's made a new friend. Yes. We found this bird and uh, it had been like abandoned by its family so we're gonna we're gonna give it a new home. Should we? I think we need to look after it, and I think we need to take it home and look after I've it. I've looked after babies Please that have been abandoned by their mums before. Please, can we take it home and look no, after it? No, it is a little Oh, I'll, we'll I'll keep take. It I'll put it in a shoebox and take it back to Fangare. It'll die by the end. I'll feed it. Oh, I'll no, look I after it. I know how to look after them. We do it all the time. I'll regurgitate for it. Watch, I can regurgitate. <laughs> <laughs> no, what you need to do. <laughs> it was abandoned by its family. Now it's got human scent on it, so they won't take it. We need to take it. It can go in my pocket. Yeah. We've found the baby bird's family, so just over here, so we're gonna go take it back to them. Oh, I don't wanna put it down. I want the baby bird. Go back, bird. Okay, we are heading off to another place at the Maori village now. Just gonna go check out the waterfall. The only thing is the waterfall's a fair long way away. And we've got no idea how to get there. Oh Faye's God. making friends with all the oh wilderness God. today. There is that a shell of one. Oh, there's a shell of one here, kid. That is disgusting. That's because of all this sound. So these things here are what are making all the noise that you can hear. These are pretty steep steps. Jesus, oh, these are steep bars. Huh? Look how steep this is. Give bars to walk in back of them. Yeah. Look how steep that is. So we walk into the waterfall now, the waterfall is just here and because it's been raining so much in Rotorua like the waterfall is like looking so good. Stop for a quick wow, I want to go for a swim. Oh, <laughs> bit wet. 
Standard no shoes, it's got to be done. Look, when we first left the house today, it was rainy and crap, and now it's brightening up. Sunshine, there's actually blue sky. Mason can't get over just how blue it is, he thinks it's so blue. So blue. Hey, Mason. <coughs> Pretty blue today. Pretty blue, in it? <laughs> Maori village now and we're heading down this really like um is om ominous a word? Yeah. Would you say this is quite ominous? I don't know what ominous means. Neither do I. I don't know what ominous means but it sounds pretty cool so I'm gonna say we're heading down this ominous looking walkway here. <laughs> I've just walked head on into a spider's web um, and then Mason said that I'll continue going first so that nobody else walks into one. Um, the reason we're walking down here is because there's apparently a green lake at the bottom, which is pretty cool. The only thing is you have to walk through all of this to get to it. How are you going, guys? Not oh, too bad. I've got a spiderweb in my face. <laughs> yeah, took one for the team. It's dodgy down here, isn't it? It's like... Well, like, is this the, the right way to go? I feel like this isn't the correct way. Yeah, honestly, nobody else is walking down here. I think we're going down the wrong place. Don't fall. Alright. <laughs> stuff keeps touching my neck. Yeah. Like, stuff keeps Even touching my face and neck. Even like that? Like yeah. Fuckloads. Keep thinking stuff is, like, crawling on me. Probably that squirrel on your head. Whee! WGS reference. What are you doing, Mason? <laughs> can't be polluting the environment like that. So we got to the bottom, and uh, you can't really... Well, as you can see, you can't really get to it. It's kind of overgrown by trees and stuff. What do you want to do? That's not a path. What do you want to do? Take pictures and go back. Take pictures and go back. I think we, we must have gone down the wrong track. Yeah, we'll get back up and I'll be like, why the hell did you get on? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So Faye just noticed this carving in a in a tree stump. That looks cool. Look at the evaporation from the heat. Oh, I'm so tired. I haven't fully uh, recovered from the bus journey today. Like, we got in to Rotorua at half five this morning. We had a bit of a sleep and then I haven't like fully recovered from it. So I'm really tired today, but I've had an awesome day. We've gone around everywhere in Rotorua. Uh, my auntie Anne showed us around and we've done actually loads today. The weather, however, is so bad, like it's actually bouncing it down outside. So whether we do anything like fun activity wise tomorrow, we're not sure. We might end up just going to the movies and watching uh, a film and going for some food. Had a great day in Rotorua. Like, awesome day like it's been really good see you tomorrow <sighs>